Hello, everyone. It has been a uh, little bit since the last episode, and I have gained the 8,000 gold necessary to buy Temi armor. I've been told in the meantime that Temi armor is not really useful, but whatever. I'm gonna buy it anyway. I sat here and typed up the money. And now it's $6,000. So. Fuck me then, I guess. God damn it, Temi. Yes. I'm not gonna buy any more. I just wanted to buy it. That's all I wanted to do. It was my successful success story that I bought this thing. So what is this thing? Temi armor. Temi armor. Armor, defense 20. The things you can do with a college education. Raise attack when worn. Recovers HP every turn. Inventory up slightly. Okay. Do that. You don the Temi armor. Uh, okay. I'm gonna say sure. I did the thing. Uh, well, in the process of doing this, I saved up a bunch of dog salad, which is actually a really good healing item. So there we go. You feel something. You're filled with determination. Alright, now time to go on to the actual... The actual thing of this, which is, uh... Undyne. There we go. Jesus. <laughs> I lost it for a second. Man, I had... I, I had taken a little bit too long of a break in between episodes. Washwa and Aaron appear. I think we should get rid of it. Oh shit, no! Ah! Fuck! I took way too long of a break, I'm an idiot! Act. Flex. Flex is thrice as hard. Ow. Flex. Next is Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. Washua is friends with a little bird. Clean me! Clean me, because apparently I didn't pick up that green one I was about to. Ah! Ah! No. Ah, frig buckets. Son of a bitch, Washua! Clean me! I want to be clean. You must wipe away the sins of my past, Washua. Also all this blood. Fucking shit. Washua! There we go, fucking finally. That took way too long. Oh yeah, this room. I gotta keep bashing buttons to make sure the lights stay on. It's not the hardest thing in the world. I basically have this down... Aw, oh, man, battles. Moldvig, I have to unhug.
Oh, Jesus, Moldig. Ah! Oh, ah, oh. Ow. All right, wash over back to this again. One thing that you may not be noticing, but uh, Temi Armor is actually healing me every turn or every bit, a little bit. It only heals one, but it's like. When you only have 20 health, one is kind of a big deal. I really don't like dealing with Washua. Wait. Shouldn't that be left? Uh, now I'm lost. Fuck. One of these should be left. There we go. Before I go anywhere, let's have some of this dog salad just to make it's literally garbage. Your HP was maxed out. Behind you. Seven! Seven human souls! With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god! With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier! He will finally take the surface back from humanity! And give them the back the suffering and pain we have endured! Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body! Undyed! I'll help you fight! Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You got a front row seat to her fight! Wait... Who's she fighting? Hey! Hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you aren't going to laugh at me. Of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Si standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go empty. Yo! Yo! I, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but... 
I, I want to ask you something. Man, I, I never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're, you're a human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it. What? Well, I, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something? But uh, I kind of stink at that. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you. P please? No, dude. Y Yo, what? So, so I have to do it? Uh, here, here, here goes nothing. Uh, yo, I, I, I hate your guts. Uh, man, I, I'm, I'm such a turd. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go home now. Yo, wait, help, I tripped. Yo, dude! If if you want to hurt my friend, you you're gonna have to get through me first. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies is just a nice thought. <laughs> Well, we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really get going home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude. Huh. That went weirdly different in an alternate timeline. There's no safe spot. I don't like that. Seven! Seven human souls and King Asgore will become a god! Six! That's how many we have collected thus far! Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed! First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No! You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell you that story when you're about to die? <laughs> You! You're standing in the way of everyone's hopes and dreams! Alfie's history books made me think humans were cool! With their giant robots and flowery swordsmen! But you! You're just a coward! Hiding behind that kid so you could run away from me again! And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes stick! I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers! You know what would make me even more valuable to everyone? If you were dead! That's right, human. Your continued existence is a crime! Your life is all that stands between us and our freedom! Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts pounding together! Everyone being... Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment! But we're not nervous at all! When everyone puts their hearts together, they can't lose! Now, human, let's end this right here, right now! I'll show you determinate, determined monsters can be blah! Step forward in when you're ready! <laughs> now there's a save point. Now I feel better.
The wind is howling. You're filled with determination. Undying Arena. Alright. Alright. That's it then! No more running away! Here I come! Unga- <laughs> My nose is getting stuffed up for some reason. UNGUARD! Undying attacks. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape! Unless you learn to face danger head on, you won't last a second against me! Undyne points heroically towards the sky. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Not bad! Then how about this? Smells like sushi. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. For years we've dreamt of a happy ending! Undyne Suplex is a huge boulder, just because she can. And... And now sunlight is just within our reach! Undyne bounces impatiently. I won't let you snatch it away from us! Undyne bounces impatiently. You tell Undyne her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. Nah! Enough warming up! Hey, we're not green anymore. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh shit! I sp I chose the wrong one. Mercy! Ha! I still can't believe you want to spare me. Now we run away. I'm out of here. Running. for me this time! I told Unland you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Honestly, I'm doing you a favor! Undyne draws her finger across her neck. Told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. No human has ever made it past Asgore! You dirty cheater. Undyne towers threateningly. You drink the sea tea, your speed boosts, your HP is maxed out. Killing you is an act of mercy! Fuck, fuck, fuck. So stop being so damn resilient! You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Alphys told me humans were determined!
Undyne flips her spear impatiently. I told Undyne he didn't want to fight. I see now what she meant by that! Undyne bounced impatiently. But I'm determined too! <laughs> that was so terrible. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. Determined to end this right now! Ooh, I wasn't expecting the last the last round. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the good ground with her business. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Right now! Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Undyne flashes a menacing smile. Undyne flashes a menacing smile. Do I have to, like, block all of them? Because that cut out before everything was done. Undyne, see you later. Ring. <laughs> hey, what's up? I was just thinking. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. Like, fuck you, virus, why? RUNNING AWAY! No. Hey Sans, what's up? No, stop sleeping! Oh. Ah. She stopped for a moment and looked at Sans. Armor! So hot! But can't give up. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water. You took a cup of water. Give Undyne the water. I guess we're all good then. Sans no longer here, unfortunately. Oh, cook, 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 cook. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Because Waterfall's not full of water. All right, whatever. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you are filled with determination. All right. So that was an exciting episode full of 
wonder and mayhem of fighting Undyne. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, but my nose is absolutely stuffed up, and it's making me sound weird. So, I'm gonna save again. And then next time, we'll talk to those knights, and we'll, uh, have some fun in a laboratory. See you all next time.